with Francine expected to make landfall on Wednesday. And we still have home preparations to do, board up windows. Boat owners in Intracoastal City are quickly bringing in their vessel before it's too late. Longtime Vermilion Parish resident Dane LeBlanc knows all too well why you shouldn't wait until the last minute. Well, we're just pulling all our stuff out of our marsh. Uh, that way the storm surge don't take it. 05, Rita took a few of our, our boats, uh, some of our blinds out of the marsh. Uh, 2008, we had the same issue, so just wanted to take the precautionary means just to make sure that it didn't happen again. Other boat owners following suit. And from one boat owner to the next, Easy. LeBlanc says whenever you can lend a helping hand, you should. And that's their livelihood, you know, and they're just trying to get out and make sure all their stuff is done as well. So any way that, that we could help in Vermillion Parish uh, and, and in the United States, that's, I mean, that's the way to do it. Download the KTC weather app to see a live Doppler from your phone and get real-time weather alerts. Reporting in Intracoastal City, I'm Penelope Lopez, your Vermillion Parish reporter.